if you genuinely care about putting the best person in front of your getting the job, then, you know, keep the math simple. If it's a hundred grand roll and they're working four days, then you're going to get 80 grand. You're going to get say 25% of the 80 grand. So you're going to get 20 grand rather than 25. You could say, okay, we've lost out on five grand, but the client's going to love us because we put Sophie or Bob in for that job and they're just brilliant. And then they're going to see that what they're able to do will come back and work with you again. Now, obviously the contingency model, the whole model, it depends on the model you're working with. But I think, which is why it comes back to the impersonal intent. If you want to take a little bit more time and invest in the future of your business, then I would encourage you to take on candidates who quite often, once you have the conversation with the client, they might be able to work more days or or appease the client that they can get the job done. Or, or it might end up being a job share. You just don't know, but you've got to want to invest in that relationship with the client. Yeah. 